All right, so this is all of my rainbow rares, and we're going to be going through every single one and telling you the price, the grade, and like the condition and stuff like that. So, Rayhan, rainbow rare. I'll just add them down. Rainbow rare. So, this one's about five dollars. Pretty cool. And it'd probably get about a 9 or 10 in PSA. Really cool artwork. Then we have Aroma Lady, which is a nice artwork. And then I'll show you the condition. Pretty cool. It'd get about like probably like a 10. I don't think it can I don't think it would get a 9. I think it just straight 10. Nice artwork. And then we have Shaman V Star. This was like one of my first ever rainbow wars I actually ever got. Nice artwork, and it would probably get about a 9 or 10, I'd say. Which is pretty cool. And then we have Oleana. This used to be my favorite rainbow rare for a while. And then I don't, I don't have a I don't really have a favorite rainbow rare now. And then I was, I'm probably sure to get like a nine. It's completely mint. Probably like, maybe actually a 10, probably. Really good condition. And then we have Eevee and Snorlax. This is the most expensive rainbow rare. Oh, I forgot. I wasn't doing the prices. So I told you Rayhan, that's about $5. Aroma Lady, $5. Shaman, 10. And Oleana, about 8 to 10. And then Eevee and Snorlax is about 80, I'd say, about $80. Yeah, and the condition on this is insane. I don't want to take it all the way out, but you could just tell that's in good condition. There's just one little thing right there. Probably get about an 8, which is still good. So that's Eevee and Snorlax. Then we have Metagross VMAX, which is about a $10 card. And condition wise, it would probably get about a 9. Or 10. It's in very good condition. Just that little side thing right there. Matagross. Nice artwork. Then we have Sharon's Care. The back would probably... Well, I would say that the card would probably get like a 10. It's just completely met. And this is about... I haven't really looked this one up. But I think it's like 5 to 10 probably. This one is about a $30 card. Very cool. Magikarp and Whale Lord. One of my favorite artworks of this card. I would say this would get probably about a 7 because of that right there. About a 7. Magikarp and Whale Lord. And then we have Ampharos GX. I actually traded for this at school. So I have not checked the condition since, but I'm pretty sure it'd be good. Yeah. Like a 9 or 10. No nicks, nothing like that. Um, I thought it was like a $15 card last time I checked. So it probably, like a 10 to $20 card. Dedene, this one is a 20 to $30 card. Very nice artwork. I would say it's, it would get like a 7 PSA. Very cool card. Then we have... Sent to Scorch V Max, about a, a five to ten dollar card. It'd get it about a nine, because it's a bit off centered. Very cool artwork though. Then we have Flapple V Max. Very cool rainbow rare. I'd say to get a nine because off centering a little bit. Could get a ten actually. Has a, has a good shot at it. Flapple V Max. Then we have Dragonite GX. Oh, Flapple is probably about a $10 card. Dragonite, about a 30 which is a really nice rainbow rare. And I would say this would get a 9 probably like a 9 Or maybe an 8 because of that thing right there. Yeah, probably like an 8 for this card, which is really cool. And then one of my favorites, actually. I forgot I had this one. One of my favorites, for sure. Love the artwork on this. This would get a 10 for sure. Amazing artwork. 
It's about a $50 card. 50 to 60 actually. This one's about a $5 to $10 card. And then PSA would probably get like a 9, I'd say. 9 or 10. Depending on how much or what they're grading, you know. Probably like a 9 or 10. Cool artwork. Then we have Leafy on VMAX. Really nice artwork. A bit off centered, so like a 9 or 10. Pretty mint. Then we have a Glaceon VMAX. So Glaceon and Leafeon are the only two EV, technically EV, besides the EV and Snorlax. So technically I have three Rainbow Rares that are EV Lucians. And then I would say I'd get it like a 10, a solid 10. Really nice artwork, about a 10 to $20 card for Leafeon and Glaceon. And then we have Cleavor V-Star, about a $10 card. Really nice artwork. The back would probably get like a 9 or 10 for the, probably if he sent it to PSA, 9 or 10. Really cool. And then we have Kindler. Kindler, I don't know, I, I forgot how to say it. Really nice artwork. Plain and simple. It would probably get about a 9 or 10. Really nice art. I like the sleeve on that one. Really nice artwork. About a $10 card. 5 to $10. Adaman. This one's cool. So this is about a 5 to $10 card. And the artwork on this would probably get about... Let's see. I would say a 9 because that's the sleeve. Yeah, okay. It would say like 9, 9 or 10. Yeah, 9 or 10. Really nice artwork. Then we have Melmetal VMAX, bought a $10 card. Really nice artwork. Get like a 10, I think it's all 10. Really nice artwork. And this is the newest rainbow where I added into my collection. Chili, Salon, and Cress. I don't know which one's which, but no, that's cool. I actually bought this one. I didn't pull it, which is you know, crazy, and then it would probably get about a $10, so that's it. Like and subscribe.